Now Sierra View TV, heading up 101 North. Gonna go up here to Humbug State Park. Gonna camp out for the night. Check it out. There's the ocean right on the left. Ah, I got the wind to crack, but really chilly here. <laughs> I know it's getting warm rest of the country, but it is just beautiful here. Let me uh, show you out the window here. Let me give you another look. That's what I'm looking at while I'm driving. And you got to keep your eyes on the road. See, there's the dash cam. That's what's recording most of the footage. That's what you're seeing most of the time. I'm holding the other GoPro. There's the rear view mirror. <laughs> See where you've been. Not bad. On Google Maps, there's a little po turnout up here. It's called Ofer. A little fishing spot. So we're going to stop. Maybe get a Zen moment. right up here. Campground's only about another five miles up the road. Stop here for a minute. Check it out. This is Ophir. O-P-H-I-R I think it was on Google Maps. All the trucks. Must be a lot of people fishing. Not sure what they fish for. I know they use huge weights because of the current uh, waves coming in. There's a couple guys sitting there. Restrooms if you need it. I wonder if this is a county thing. I don't know. Picnic tables. Look how blue the water looks. Big ol' waves crashing here. Alright, I'm going to get a little closer. all kinds of people down here fishing. They're quite a ways up up and down along the beach here. starting to get tired. It's been a long day. Did quite a bit of filming. This will be busted up in uh, three videos probably today that you'll see. <coughs> okay load up in the van and go find that campground.
left. This will be 101 north. That sign straight across says Gold Beach 9, Port Orford 16. A sign coming up. Humbug Mountain Day Use. Nope, we're looking for campground. Should be about another quarter mile up on the right. Man, look at the steepness of this mountain. And the ocean is straight out. Cool. <laughs> Here it is. Yay. Humbug Mountain Campground. We made it. State Park. all self-serve all you do is park fill out a ticket throw it in a box and you're done put the receipt in the windshield okay I'm gonna get parked and we'll go walk around okay everything's blacktop you park on pavement there's actually hookups on some of these and non hookups. Very nice. I got a non hookup. I'm dry camping. Don't need power. I got solar. It's nice to have electric though once in a while. Big old fifth wheel there, that's a camp hose. Right up here on the right there's a covered bridge, wooden bridge. And a sign, I think it goes over to the other side of the highway. There's uh, hiking trails here. Day, whatever. Okay, here's the little bridge I seen. And you go across and that's hiking trails. Uh, there's a culvert pipe. Looks like you walk underneath the highway here. <laughs> oh, we gotta do this. Creek bed flow in there. Wish I had my gold pan. Check this out. <laughs> well, that was weird. <laughs> wow, look at the trail. I'm tired. I got been at it all day. I'm not going to go very far. I'm going to go back. But check it out. You can hike all through here. If you're a hiker, what's that sign say? Three miles. No way. You can go up to the top three miles. Oh my god. wonder if they got a motorized lift <laughs> in the oxygen bottle okay, here's a day use parking area campgrounds cross the road right there well isn't this cool camp walk underneath the road go hiking crawl back <laughs> All right, I'm heading back.
Look at the little stream. Wonder if there's any gold in there. Gold, gold pan it. There's the bridge. All right. Well, while I'm still alive, I'm gonna w let's walk over the ocean real quick before I call it a night. And they got a little visitor information booth, pamphlets. I'm telling you, state of Oregon, they know how to run a state park system. Goodness, this is nice. Hot showers and restrooms, everything. The rate here is $17 to camp overnight. You get showers, restrooms, everything else, trash. They have water uh, around the campsites. Okay, I grabbed some fresh batteries out of the van. Let's. Ocean's not very far. We got to walk through a little, another little trail, and then under a bridge. Fly the drone later and get a shot of the bridge, the ocean, and the park. I'll put that at the end of this video. So be sure to watch it all the way to the end. Heavy winds, but I can really hear the roar of the ocean coming up this little gully here, this canyon. There's the 101 bridge. Tomorrow we'll be traveling on that to the right. To the right's north, to the left to be south. Okay, hike up here. Some people coming. Hi, how are you guys? Hello. This sand's hard to walk in a little bit, carrying all this camera stuff. Well, that's an old concrete span bridge, huh? That's seen its day. Bet that this creek gets up there too, flooding. Humbug Mountain. There's everything you're not supposed to do. I don't see anything about a drone, so. We'll fly that. Look at all the birds. Can you hear them? Birds chirping. They got nest built up there. Hey, okay, there's the ocean. And that creek empties into the ocean. There it is. It's about as far as I want to go. Tired. I want to get back to the van. Call it a day. There it is. What a beautiful drive today. We've seen a lot. Already heading back. Yeah, them birds are everywhere. Hear the cars going over top. Okay, gonna call this home for the night. Yay. Humbug State Park. Tomorrow we're going to go up to Port Orford and a little farther, I think. Oh no, I'll have to map it out tonight. Then I'll fly the drone here once the wind calms down a little later. Alright, down description, there's a way to support the channel. Buy me a cup of coffee. 
shop on Amazon, even get a t-shirt, coffee mug, anything. That all really helps, and I want to thank everyone for doing it. Okay, everyone take care. Watch the video for the aerial coming up right now. Thank you.